question 19. According to the passage, the term paid bodyguard syndrome refers to the phenomenon in which, so if we go to the reading and we focus in the very first paragraph, specifically self-defense through what might be called the paid bodyguard syndrome so here's where it's mentioned has been documented from a variety of plants all of them meaning all the plants manage to keep a horde of ants on themselves these ants bite or sting any attackers thus protecting their host from damage so essentially the ants are protecting these plants from damage which is why they're pretty much the plants bodyguard so if we go through the options, A, a plant defends itself from the hordes of invading ants. So if the plant, we know that the plant is not defending itself from the horde, it is actually keeping a horde of ants on themselves so that the ants can defend them. So we can cross off A. B, ants protect themselves from other aggressive species. So the bodyguard syndrome talks about plants having ants, so it's not about the ants protecting themselves, more so the ants protecting the plant, so we can cross off B. C, ants instinctively defend their queen against attacks by other animals. The ants and their queen is not mentioned here, it's more about the ants defending plants, so we can cross off C. Finally, D, a plant supports colonies of ants that protect it from harmful animals. So this one is the one that makes the more sense because the plant keeps a horde of ants on them because the ants protect them from harmful animals. So final answer for 19 is D.